Today we're going to be looking at a new CSS feature that's going to help you theme your light mode and dark mode for your site. The new CSS feature that we'll be looking at is called Light Dark. And as of Chrome 123, it's available and has decent coverage, mainly for newer browsers. Before we get into how Light Dark works, let's look at how we currently theme light and dark themes. So here we have a root with a color scheme inside. And all this is saying is that our page is comfortable rendering in both light and dark mode. So down below, we have our media queries for prefers color scheme dark and prefers color scheme light. And this is more or less where you put your theming in for dark mode and light mode. So for dark mode, I'm putting a background of black with a color of white. And for light mode, I'm doing a background of white and a color of black. So looking at this in the browser, I have dark mode by default. And as you see, the background is black and the text is white. So a little tip in Chrome, if you want to change the preferred color scheme, uh, there's a rendering panel, and you can just get that by doing Command Shift P and type in rendering or Control Shift P on Windows. And this opens up. You just scroll down to emulate CSS media, and you can change it from dark to light. And as you can see, our background is now white and our text is black. One thing I want to bring up, you might have noticed that when I changed the color scheme, the content changed as well. And this was purely for the joke. Typically, you wouldn't change the content when you switch the themes. But it brings up a good point. Light dark only deals with color. You can't do this sort of thing where you're hiding and showing things based on the color scheme. Sorry to slow you down. Let's get back to color schemes. Now, there's nothing necessarily wrong with how we're doing this. It's just very verbose. There's a lot of lines kind of going on here to support just changing of colors. And light dark is just a, a short form of doing this essentially. So looking at the light dark feature now, when we want to swap out the color based on the preferred color scheme, we can now use this light dark function. And the first one is for the light preferred. And the second one is for the dark preferred. So now we look, nothing has changed. Go back to dark, looks exactly the same. And just to prove that it does work, I'll change this to red. And red, come back. Now we have red background. And now we have red text. Now I'm going to switch it back to dark mode here. And I'm going to go back to our editor. I'm just going to quickly switch these back to black. And how light dark works is actually based off of the color scheme. So we can override what the user has selected and force a color scheme if we wanted. So if I do this sort of thing where color scheme is light, even though I have dark selected in my browser, it will force it. So now I have a, a light theme, even though I have my preferred color scheme as dark. Now I wouldn't recommend doing this, but I just wanted to let you know that it is entirely possible to do this. I just want to give a big shout out to the artist that actually created these images. I think they're absolutely hilarious. I'm going to leave a link in the description to where I found them. Uh, it's, it's an artist by the name of Powell, and he has a whole slew of different images of a day in the life of Darth Vader. It's pretty hilarious. So be sure to check that out. And if you like this type of content, be sure to like and subscribe to see what's coming next. And thanks for watching. See you next time.